Hello, it is Cheap Nails having you say frugal with nail art. And in this video, <laughs> and in this video, I'm gonna be showing you these beautiful glitters, every one of them. So go, let's go take a look at them right now, right now. Okay, we'll start off with the first polish. It's this gold glitter polish. It's got medium and large uh, glitter in it, and it's the Midas Touch. I'm not sure why it's named that. I think it's some kind of inside joke, but uh, I didn't get the inside joke. And I'm going to be swatching all the nail polishes on a color wheel because I wanted to do it on my original nail, my natural nails, but then uh, they're just not in the right condition right now because the winner has just been hot on them. So I'm going to be using this color wheel. And so I'm gonna just swatch it on and these brushes that uh, Shanty has, they're not too large, not too small, they're just pretty much just the right size. I like the brush that they have and as you can see it's very uh, sparse, it's kind of just a clear polish with some glitter in there. It's very pretty. So I wanted to swatch it over uh, white and black polish just to see like if it was good for a topper and I think it's very pretty for just like a gl gl glow, glow, <laughs> gold low-key uh, glitter if you want. I think if you sponge it on it will look amazing. Okay, next polish is this orange polish and this is Dragon's Breath and it is really similar to uh, like Bloody Orange from Broadway. It reminds me of that nail polish and it's very pretty. It has a gold shimmer to it and it has a couple of like just a, it's not like fully on like large glitter but every once in a while you get a large glitter in there so it has like some sparse large glitter but it's very pretty and really nice orange. And the next one is uh, Ruby Slippers which is this red glitter which is absolutely beautiful. I think it's a combination between like a large glitter and like smaller red glitter but it is beautiful and it's opaque in three coats and I was really impressed with this one. I just love it. I love spongy. It looks great sponged on and so this is definitely one of my favorites out of this collection because it is so pretty. And I also wanted to try it over black and white nail polish as a topper just to see what that looks like. And I love it on the white and the black. I think it works really well as a topper. I think it's beautiful. The next glitter nail polish is Unicorn Kiss and it is a full-on rainbow glitter with like silver uh, shimmer to it. It is beautiful. And I'm this is probably definitely more of a topper because it's not really, you can get it pretty opaque with like three coats, but basically I think you need to sponge it on, which it will look beautiful. Or I wanted to put it over white and black like as a topper and I think it did really well. It's just like this subtle um, rainbow glitter and you can see the silver really good, the little silver glitter in there when you put it on black nail polish, so it's beautiful. Okay, next polish is this silver holographic polish and it is named Pixie Dust and it truly looks like it has pixie dust in there along with large pieces of holographic uh, glitter. And this uh, was definitely probably need like three coats. Even if you put three coats on it, it's not really opaque. So I was like, let's use it as a topper and swatch it over black and white to see what that looks like. And it looked beautiful as a topper. I think it really uh, shines and comes out on, uh, on black, the color black. I think it just looks beautiful. And it's really holographic and it's a really nice silver uh, polish. Next is Fairy Tale, and it is a uh, kind of hot pink glitter with like large pieces of glitter in there and just silver pieces of glitter. And it is beautiful. I love pink nail polishes. I love glitter pink nail polishes. And this was definitely, it was opaque on two coats. You can put a third one on there. But I think it was so pretty. It really reminds me of a polish I had when I was younger. And it was, it's just beautiful. Okay, next one is a purplish pink glitter and its name is Pegasus Wings and I think that's a really pretty and accurate name for this polish because it's beautiful and it has like silver glitter in there not many large pieces of glitter maybe a couple it's just like kind of like that uh, pink one before this very light and it was opaque in two coats but my nails were short when I put it on so I'm guessing if you have longer nails you will probably need three coats but it is a very pretty light purple almost pink kind of glitter. Okay, the next one is called G 
Good Witch, which I think is kind of a dumb name for it because it doesn't look anything like a witch. Like, witches are like black and green, and this is a, just a lovely pink with kind of purple glitter added to it, and it is beautiful. It reminds me more of like a Barbie dress than like a witch, so I don't really think that's an accurate name for it. And this is just a very soft and uh, light pink with like purple glitter in it, and it is beautiful. And I got it to be probably opaque in two coats. If you have longer nails, maybe three coats. Next glitter polish is Ice Queen, which is so pretty because it has really ultra fine silver glitter added to it. No bigger glitters, no large glitters. It's just fine glitter and it is so pretty. It reminds me of like the perfect like Elsa frozen color because it's just so pretty. And I got it to be opaque in two coats and it's just like this gentle light blue and it's just beautiful. Okay, next glitter polish is The Genie, which is a dark uh, blue glitter polish, and it has like large holographic glitter added to it and like light silver um, ultra fine glitter added to it, and it is beautiful. And I think uh, it was opaque in two coats, but you probably want to th throw on a third coat. It is just beautiful. It's just, I've never had like a dark blue glitter nail polish, and I think it was beautiful, so. So next we have up is this green uh, holographic glitter polish, which is called Mermaid Tail, and I love the name I, of this polish. I think it's just perfect for it. And uh, this is probably like my favorite one out of the whole collection because it is very opaque. I like, it's opaque in two coats. It's very opaque for a glitter nail polish. I mean, it doesn't really look opaque, but once you put the second coat on it, it is just opaque. And it's just a beautiful green holographic glitter nail polish it is beautiful okay next up we got this like bluish green holographic glitter it is called Loch Ness I think they mean like Loch Ness monster or something I hope I'm saying that right I don't even know but it is a very pretty and it's got large pieces of glitter that are holographic in it and silver ultra fine glitter added to it and it is beautiful and uh, I don't know if it's exactly opaque if you put two coats on it looks pretty good maybe three coats but it's more like a sponge. You want to probably sponge this one on. I think it would look at its full opacity and look awesome sponged on. It would just be beautiful. Now I'm just going to go ahead and put another coat on all the polishes that I showed you. Because I think they uh, just look beautiful with a second coat. That orange one's probably the most opaque one out of this whole collection. Because it just looks great. This rainbow glitter and the silver uh, holographic glitter. I think that would probably work better as a topper or sponged on because it would look pretty, but all these glitters would probably be full opacity sponged on. This pink glitter reminds me of something from my childhood. It's like, I don't know, I, I don't know, I think I had it when I was younger. And the light purple one's beautiful, and this light pink one is beautiful. Please forgive me if I have a little, if you hear like a little bit of a raspy voice, because I've had a sore throat this whole week, and um, this winter weather, man, Tell me if it's cold where you at because it's cold here and I got a sore throat and it's just, it's bitterly cold here and this winter has just hit my uh, natural nails hard and uh, so it's kind of hard to have them on camera right now because my nails and my cuticles just look, ugh, they just don't look good because they're so dry. But tell me down in uh, the comment section down below which is your favorite uh, glitter nail polish. I don't know, I love all of them, especially the mermaid tail one. I think they're all so beautiful so please tell me and tell me how I did on my swatch in review this is only like my second one I have not done many swatching reviews um, so tell me how I did and thank you guys so much for watching my video click or tap the screen to subscribe or to click or tap the screen to watch another one of my videos thank you so much for being here with me and I'll see you next time bye